Packers ready? Yeah, I hope so. <laughs> the fourth stage of the USA Pro Challenge is just about to start at the Broadmoor. KRDO News Channel 13's Carl Winder is live at the starting line. Carl. Good afternoon, John. Good afternoon, Good afternoon John and Brittany. We're about 20 seconds away from the start of stage four. More than 100 of the best cyclists in the world are riding 70 miles in Colorado Springs. We're 10 seconds away. You can hear the cowboys going off. Everyone's getting excited. You have the camera is all up. Everyone's Three, waiting. One. And now they're off. Cameras are going off. Who's leading right now is TJ Von Garderin. He won stage three. They're heading toward Old Broadmoor right now. The finish line is going to be on Pikes Peak and Tejon in downtown after this stage five. We'll start in Woodlawn Park at about 11 tomorrow morning. The finish line, like I said, will be in downtown on Pikes Peak and Tejon right now. They're heading toward Old Broadmoor Road in Colorado Springs. Carl Winder, KRDO News Channel 13. All right. Thanks so much, Carl. Very exciting. Now, he's mentioned while they're just taking off of the Broadmoor, it'll be about three hours, I believe, until they finish up downtown. Uh, and lots of stuff going on downtown, though. So, A, be aware of that if you're headed downtown. Lots of closures, but B, lots of fun stuff, too. Yeah. I mean, booths set up and... Something for everybody. Yeah. Uh, they make it fun. And I thought the start for some of those riders looked... Very relaxed. You yeah, did you see one, one guy, guy was just, like stretching? Yeah. I guess, you know, uh, once they kind of separate from the pack, maybe that's when well, they uh, start going for a time. This is the easy part because they're going through Garden of the Gods and Mesa Road and Ridge Road, and those are some pretty elevated roads. So, this, that's why they're taking it easy now. All they're right. going to have to be tough later. Well, and of course, uh, we showed you the start. We'll have highlights of the finish for you coming up later on KRDO News Channel 13 this evening.